Hello everyone, and welcome back to Stranded Sail. My name is Melanie B. Okay, so on last episode, we got to unlock the Ancestor by doing all the three pyramid connections to the three islands we've explored so far. But now we have a request to find an old rudder in the sandbars. And we'll get around to getting that done, but let's go ahead and harvest some crops. And it looks like we got a lot of crops to water as well. Um, is there any more spots we can plant anything in? Nope, looks like we don't have any open spots for seeds. But we definitely got lots to water. Okay, there's our water bucket. And let's get all of these watered. Okay, everything is watered now. And we're gonna have to make some stew, of course, for everyone. So, let's get some corn there. Do a few corn. And we'll just do one potato, since we're kind of running low on potatoes. Uh, carrots. And let's try some rice. Who are we gonna try some rice on? Let's try rice on them. Eggplants. I don't think anybody likes eggplants. <laughs> oh, we got two things that Logan likes. That's nice. Two options for him. Lucky guy. Uh, clam. Don't know who likes that. Let's try some black pepper. I wonder if people can have multiple things. No, they cannot. Okay, I think we got something for everyone. Not quite. There we go, some fresh thyme. And for Papa Charles, let's throw some ginger here. And we'll make some stew. This should be some interesting stew. for our rewards. I don't really want to use that just yet. But we definitely want to have a couple bowls of stew though. And do we have enough food for ourselves? I think so. And we need to do some more experimentations, definitely. Let's do one more corn on the cob. That should have us all filled up. So we need to explore the sandbars. Let's head in this direction. So it says the sandbars in front of the beach. It has to be around here. It has to be this little area here, but I thought we kind of explored there last time. I didn't really find anything. We'll go look again. There is our rowboat. And off we go. Well, there's a sack here. I'll open that up. There's definitely not going to be a rudder in a sack, though. <laughs> Why is this one not opening? That took forever. We got some thyme, sugar, and allspice. Oh. Let's dig up and see what we find here. It's probably going to be some key shards, but we definitely like those. Yep, we got three of them. Okay. There's these two islands here we haven't explored. There might be something on them. 
There's a lot of little stuff we can check here. Looks like a bit of debris on each of these islands. So let's just go to this island right over here next. Into a rowboat we shall go. See what's here. Oh, there's a fishing spot there. Oh, what is this? Oh, there we go. Broken rudder. That's what we're looking for. Um, let's break open this. Got some rope pieces. And we will activate this rune spot. Um, I wonder if you'll find a new fish there. I think I should be doing more fishing, but we can just go back to our camp now. Take a little shortcut there. So we need to just talk to Sven now. Okay, let's go see Sven. Here he is. <laughs> Oi, Claire, you found an old rudder. Oh my, it's shredded. Here, I will show you how you can repair it at the crafting station. So, reliable rudder blueprint. Okay, I guess we're gonna do the hard work. Because Sven is too busy to do it. Okay, so... Reliable rudder. We got everything we need. We'll do that. And back to Sven we shall go. Guess what, Sven? We got it fixed. Hey! Hey, sailor. Ah, the rudder looks great, just like new. We will have it installed in no time so that we can continue with the next stage. Thank you, Claire. I've heard that Cecile wants to see you. Hurry, don't want her to throw a tantrum again. Haha. <laughs> Why does Cecile want to see me? Um, this is not hmm. Cecile, this is Teresa. There's Cecile. Cecile is up this way. <clears throat> yeah. Bonjour, I was looking for you. Okay, Claire. This whole situation we are in is not easy for me to handle. As an award-winning chef, I'm not used to outdoor camping and simple stews. But I see that you're working really hard. Probably harder than everyone else. I want to show you some appreciation for your effort. Please take my old lunchbox. With this two field of prepares with your help, I don't have a use for it anymore. Okay, oh, our food capacity has increased. Perfect. So, let's go chat with our little parrot friend next. So, that means we can have one more dish we can carry. That is great. Hey, parrot. The parrot is bouncy and seems to want to tell you something. It has a message in its claw. It's from the ancestor. Oh. He has located the first golden statue. You should go and visit him up on his pyramid. We will do just that. Um, do we need any more stew? Nope, not yet. Let's run up to the top of the pyramid. Pyramid is quite a ways to get to though, but we'll make it. Okay, here we are. Ancestor, what did you need? Hmm. Greetings, Claire. Good to see that you have received my message. I have located the first statue. It's not too well hidden, but I have to warn you. In the northeastern corner of your map, you will have noticed a large island. It bears an old hideout filled with a group of forlorn pirates. 
your captain guard this one statue is unjustly acquired treasure even after death he is determined to fend off anyone who dares to come near it be wary of this mighty foe claire you have defeated some of these ghostly rascals already but this one requires more precaution claire there's another obstacle for you to overcome you will have to traverse dangerous waters to reach this corner of your map. High waves will try to capsize your boat and drown you with certainty. Do not worry, Claire. I can assist you in this regard. I will grant you access to my old canoe, hidden for ages below this monument. Its sleek shape will make it easy for you to reach your destination even through high waves. Make sure to use it when you try to reach this perilous island. Also, see that you are always prepared for such a long and tedious journey. Bring only your most effective rations with you, as many as you can. Um, I will try. So we need to find an old canoe. Down there. That must be the old canoe the ancestor was talking about. How am I getting down there? Uh, yeah, I can't go off to the side. Can I go around this way? Oh, I guess I can. How come I never went here before? <laughs> um, unless I just unlocked it. Got some more shiny plunder. And there is another room spot to activate here. So there is our canoe. I think I want to get... I wonder if we can call the canoe to the other point as well. Okay, well, we need to head out northeast. So we'll need to go this way. And this is the one we were being blocked with the storm before. Okay, well, let's jump into the canoe and see how much progress we can make. Have another look at our map here. Yeah, we got quite a ways to go. I wonder if we will see anything new on our way over. The waters are starting to get a little bump here. close are we? We're a ways away. <laughs> but we'll keep paddling. Eventually we've got to get there. Well, it's raining a bit and the waves are definitely getting bigger. But we're doing much better than we did in our rowboat. Here we are. Oh, this is just a ship. What is another ship doing out here? Okay, we have made it on to the new shore. There is maybe quite a few ships have crashed here. There's a digging spot. Let's see what we find. Maybe it's just going to be more key shards, but we want more key shards, so we'll take that. Now, there is the you. Let's go see. A strong ghostly aura is surrounding this. Let's touch it. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. There's a lot. A lot of them this time. Oh boy. Can we take these guys all down? They are tough. Ah, we managed to hold them off. Got some hardwood fragment. So find the first golden statue. Seems the barrier at the cape entrance got weaker. What cape entrance? Well, I certainly don't see a cave. Let's have a look at this map here a little bit more. Okay, can we go into the water? Definitely not.
So maybe we just need to get back into our rowboat. And let's go around this way and see what we find. Look at all these shipwrecks. Okay, let's get up here. Yeah, maybe there's a cave around here. Oh, here it is. This entrance is blocked by a ghostly barricade. You should explore the area and find a way to remove it. So maybe we have to take down some more... Some more enemies and it will weaken every time we destroy a new enemy. What is this here? Captain Barbaro's logbook, page 104, lore artifact. We'd been on this high sea for weeks when we spotted a speck of land not on our map. Closing in on our find, we revealed an archipelago crowned by an ancient pyramid. Well, that's the place we have discovered as well. I better not open that. I don't want to use my energy. Um, there's a blink rune we can activate. There's another book up there. Hmm. But I'm not seeing any place we can... ...discover any... ...enemy. Let's climb up this way. And what are we gonna find here? Let's just go ahead and open this. Might be something new. No, just some rugged rope. And we'll have to clear this out here. Uh, we're running low on energy already. Let's have some of our corn here. Maybe we'll have a second one. Yeah, that's gonna give us a bit of energy for now. And we'll read the bug. Captain Barbaro's book two or four. The sight of the Grand Pyramid was all it took to convince the crew to drop the anchor. We landed on the island and made our way to the top of waiting endless treasure. But you did not find endless treasure, did you? There's another book up here, but how do we get to that next level? We need something like a ladder for sure. Hmm. Well. Can we get over this way? No. Definitely no place to climb up here. But we are supposed to get up to the top for sure. We just need to find a way up there. It looks like there's a cave exit here. So maybe once we get in here, we can get up to this point. But we need to figure out how we can break down that cave a little bit more. The entrance, anyway. I see another digging spot. Maybe we can find a portal so we can access this area easier. Okay, let's try going in this direction. There's a treasure box there. We're gonna leave that alone. Okay, let's clear this out. See what we find over in this direction. Great, we got a portal. One portal stone activated. And another logbook. Captain Barbaro's logbook, page 3 of 4. We reached the highest platform of the pyramid, only to find it empty. Were it not for those three golden statues, we left and took them with us, disappointed to not find more. Hmm... Oh, 
Well, I'm not sure where we can go from this point. We really need to just weaken the cape entrance. Maybe we can get in our boat and get over to this side a little bit more. Or maybe we should go on to these islands here. Yeah, maybe these three islands here might have some more enemies for us to dispatch. We're kind of running low on energy. Let's have something to eat again. Okay, where's our boat? Should be close by here. There it is. Okay. Oops. We need to paddle out. It is so late though. Is it a good time for fighting enemies? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can only imagine how difficult this is going to be. Let's get this treasure. Before we start our fight. Who knows how difficult these guys are going to be this time. I can't imagine they're easy though. Yeah. Pretty much the same as the last group. We're taking damage. Okay, the main guy is gone. These guys should be a bit easier. Okay, got him. And the barrier has grown weaker, so just one more island just up there. Might as well go and see. We have a bit of energy. Even if it's kind of late. Let's see if we can take it down. Today. Before we get back home. Might have to eat one more meal. Okay, this should be the last one. Get these guys eliminated. Okay, all five are gone. Is there anything to dig up around here though? I'm really hoping I can recall my boat because I want to head back home. So we'll have to try recalling our canoe. But let's get back to the campsite. And it is very dark, so we should just call it a night. Okay, and I think that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.